Hey coach, I uh, hope you're liking the video. If you are, kick down below. Um, that would help us a ton. Hit the like button down below. If you want to subscribe, that'd be awesome. Hit the little bell up above. You'll get a notification every time um, one of our new videos goes live. Um, also, make sure you go over and check out teachhoops.com. Enjoy. Hey coach, this is Coach Van with Next Play Hoops, back again with another video book preview. And today we're going to take a look at the swing offense, uh, an offense that uh, Greg Popovich and Bo Ryan made famous with the San Antonio Spurs and the Wisconsin Badgers. Uh, we actually uh, pay homage to uh, Wisconsin, and that's the name of our uh, swing series is Wisconsin. So uh, you'll see some of our terminology. Um, as we get into it, but like our basic swing offense uh, continuity, for example, is called Wisconsin. Um, and then everything else is Wisconsin three, Wisconsin T, Wisconsin 12 fist, et cetera. So um, this is uh, basically kind of like a numbered break. Everything in the swing offense can be used as a, a secondary break in the numbered break, if you wish. Um, if you're familiar with our Carolina break, uh, which is our numbered secondary break, uh, very similar, a lot of the same plays, um, in our Carolina breaker and our swing offense as well. So um, uh, we're going to take a look at the table of contents first. Um, but uh, this book has 243 pages in it. Uh, there's three continuity offenses. Uh, we give you 34 different quick hitters uh, that you can use or call to counter what the defense is trying to do. Um, and we give you over 175 pages in, in practice drills and breakdown drills that you can use uh, for your team as well. Uh, so you'll see here, again, we get straight into our swing offense. Um, and then you'll see our Wisconsin T-Series continuity offense. And then we give you our Tar Heel continuity offense. And then you have some counters within those. Um, and then we get into our drill section, our swing offense drills. And then we give you... Uh, our swing passing drills, because we want to make sure that we're swinging the ball, moving the ball from side to side. We want to work on our passing drills. Uh, then we work on our swing and double stagger shooting drills, because we run a lot of double staggers uh, in our swing offense. And then we have our T-series action, which is our screen, the screener action. Um, and that's our terminology and uh, vocabulary within our playbook. So again, when you, you pick the Wisconsin or swing offense, uh, you're going to probably pick, you know, anywhere from five to 10 different plays, counter plays that you want to choose. Uh, obviously, you're not going to take all 34 quick hitters and, and put a, punch them into your playbook. Uh, you want to make sure that it specifically fits to your team and uh, your, your team's personnel. Uh, but here is the basic uh, swing offense concept. You see here, we got a one, four, uh, and the two and three, uh, the wings, and then we got one guy inside. So it's a four out one in. Uh, the number two and four on this weak side are always going to interchange when the ball goes over here. Uh, you'll see a UCLA screen here. And, um, and then five will flash. And uh, we got the interchange going on, on the weak side. Now, as we go into frame five and six, you'll see here one comes up and sets a back screen. Three is going to cut as we pass the ball over to two. So we might be able to hit one or number three there. Uh, but if we don't have it, again, we got the interchange going on the weak side and, and we're just kind of in continuity and we just go and we just play side to side. Three can now step up, set a back screen for four, comes off um, and then pop out. We swing the ball and then all of a sudden four will now be down here. We'll set the back screen for two and we're in the rip action just like we are in frame five and we're in our continuity. Now you'll see here in these frames, everything is color coded. Um, each uh, frame has a description um, to help um, – uh, explain exactly to the coaches what's going on. We give you different rules. We give you different breakdowns. We give you different reads uh, to make it easy for all coaches to understand what's happening within each frame. You can print these, take them to practice. Uh, again, everything is color coded. Uh, so it's easy to read and uh, decipher the offense from the defense and passes and whatnot. And you can print these, take them to your practice, take them to your games. They work on an iPad, they work on an iPhone and, um, uh, you, you can share these with your coaches and um, it's kind of a nice little feature. So uh, let's go ahead and take a look at uh, our Wisconsin section. This is one of my favorites here where our Wisconsin corner 
uh, where we pass the ball to two, one cuts all the way through to the weak side, four and three just fill. We swing the ball, five sets of back screen for three after the pass to one. We look for three possibly, and then five goes into an immediate ball screen for number one. Could have the pick and roll here. As that's happening, we got a little interchange over here um, on the weak side to occupy the defense. One can pass to four different players. Uh, it's extremely effective. It's nice for your point guard. Uh, the defense really has to help out. X5 has to help out on number three here on the cut. And if he doesn't, um, that'll be open. But uh, if he does, then it's very hard to be able to play that pick and roll situation here. So um, again, if you have a point guard, it's just uh, it's a nice little play call to get the, the ball and the pressure off your point guard and to uh, uh, put X1 into a and X5 into a, um, a surprise pick and roll situation. So uh, you will see here in the backup action, though, if we never did make the pass here to one, this is frame five in that play. Uh, four can flash. We'll hit four, and that's when we go into our blind pig action for a possible backdoor wide open lane. Uh, we can also pass the ball here, too. Here's another option B. We can go into pinch post. Uh, if we can't hit four, we can pass the ball to two, who will then hit four, and then we go into pinch post action where we can get a DHO for a possible land. And if we do that and we don't hand the ball off to two, two will flare here to the corner, and then we can go into a stagger, kind of double stagger Chicago action where four goes into a DHO with number one. Um, so again, a lot of different options just in that one play, and we give you 34 different plays to choose from. Uh, here's our T-Series. Uh, this is a play that uh, Rick Majerus ran at Utah when he had Andre Miller and Keith Van Horn. You'll see a Tar Heel continuity offense, which is the shuffle screen offense continuity that uh, Dean Smith had run years ago. And then we go into our swing offense drills. Um, and you can use these drills in practice. And with our swing passing drills. These are our swing and double stagger shooting drills. And then here's our screen to screen or T-series action drill. So 243 plays. This is the Wisconsin swing offense, four out, one in. You can use it as a secondary break as well if you wish. And uh, if you have any questions, feel free to email me anytime at coachvan at nextplayhoops.com. And uh, we'll see you at the next video. Thanks, guys. Hey coach, hope you're liking the video. Hope you are. Uh, make sure you like down below. That will help a ton. Um, and it helps our videos. Other people find us. Also go over and check out um, the subscribe button and the little bell will help you get notified when we put a new video up every day. Check teachhoops.com for coaches who want to get better.